Uh, uh. Alright, so this is essentially uh, Mario, but with, uh, but with a bird. We collect eggs. And uh, we try to collect the eggs while, while you're getting to the end of the level. I haven't coded in en enemies yet. And I'm not quite sure what they're going to be. But, uh, uh, but you can jump and in the uh, the most points you can get up here on the jumping islands or in the little treetops is 63. So it's essentially like Flappy Bird and Mario and Pokemon and everything kind of like a yeah. mashup, right? Yeah, yeah, it's kind of, yeah, it's got a lot of video game references. Um, like the bird is uh, po is the Pokemon bird from Red and Blue when you use Fly to get around places. And so if you so it, it's a platformer game as well. So it, what happens if you fall off of the platform? Do you end up? Yeah, you should end up dead, but there okay. but there's a little secret area. And there's three of these pipes. Oh wow, you got pipes as well. So yeah. You designed all you you drew everything on pixel art and everything. Yeah, I found some pictures and and then there's and then uh there's some extra secret eggs down here that give you um that give you ten points each. Yeah. And then there's a little secret area over here. You can get to it. It's Mewtwo from Pokemon. Oh, nice. A little bit of Pokemon reference. He says the thing. And then uh and they makes a they uses like a psychic attack and disappears. So they use a lot of overlap blocks and yeah, and um, a lot of walls, especially okay. for like the little stair for the staircase. The staircase. Nice. And then are those alligators down at the bottom? Yes, those are alligators, and and I haven't coded in yet. But once you overlap these guys, you just instantly die. And then once you overlap this trophy, I've coded this trophy, but for the I haven't coded the other trophy yet. Sweet. Can we can we see the code real quick? Yeah. And so once you get going, you got the basic premise. Yeah. It gets a little bit easier because you got kind of a baseline that you can duplicate blocks and just modify it and change it to a different enemy or a different sprite, right? Yeah. Okay. What what do you think about this Make Code platform? Oh, I love it so much. I've used this. I've used this a lot. Yeah. I've made two games on it. Would you recommend this to students? Yes. Why? Why? It's just super fun. Um, you get to you get to make your own video games. There's even a forum where you can publish them, and you have a chance to actually get them on on Make Code. Oh, have you done that yet? Or are you gonna wait till you finish yeah. that one? No, I, I've I've put it on the forum. It just haven't showed up yet. I said that you can publish it on here. It's ah, here we go. And then if you look around, these are games that people have made, and uh, there's a then a, if you uh, and there's a little area over here that says uh, add a game. And then you pub and then you publish it on the forum. This is uh, my forum account actually. Just uh, um, yep, here we go. And so you just publish it to the forum. Yeah, you, yeah. Yeah, there's yeah, there's a bunch of game stuff on here. And um I just publish it down. I've got, I can actually search it right now. Sweet.